Good morning, y'all. Today we're doing a productive days in my life. And I absolutely love these videos because y'all truly hold me accountable. Like sitting here having to film the things that I'm doing in my day and labeling it as a productive days in my life truly makes me do all the things I need to do. So I'm starting off the day with some good old matcha. I've been loving adding the Trader Joe's brown sugar creamer. And I'm just checking on the garden this lovely morning. Morning. everything is looking so cute everybody is growing so well we haven't had any issues just yet but everything is looking so good and i just had to check on all the little plant babies i just had to i do this every morning but let's go ahead and do the dreaded task of editing i love editing actually but it does get a bit tedious so you do have to hype yourself up to do it but this has been a really good way just to you know add a little bit of fun pizzazz to my editing because i'm filming it for you all so hopefully this this lighting is doing what it needs to do but i'm about to go ahead and head to the library and pick up a book that i had on hold i honestly don't even know why i'm wearing this tote bag because the only thing in it is a chapstick and a rice krispie treat and i'm about to eat that rice krispie treat in the car so it's really no reason but i like that i like to wear my little tote bag especially when i'm going to the library it's, it's cute it's cute so let me go ahead and go for traffic hits and i'll see y'all in a bit that rhymed <laughs> I'm just really excited to read this book and explore what is love and I can't wait to report back. I'm so excited to like get into some of these like harder reads that make you reflect and think about life and all those things. I've been reading a lot of fiction books which has been fun um, like easier fiction books which has been fun about relationships and love so it just seems right that this should be like one of the next books that I read. Pho is just one of those meals that I love to have during a productive week because you can still eat fresh veggies every single day and you can have some variety in your meal prep. So today I'm making a bowl really heavy on zucchini. So we got zucchini for dinner today and I'm just making my bowl as I do when we have pho. It's just, it's just so good. It's a very labor intensive meal to start out because you have to do all the meal prep with the veggies and work on the broth but it's so good it's so worth it it really really is yeah Try to finish up this vlog hopefully today I have a little bit more to edit um, but hopefully I can get this done in the next day or so because life is gonna start lifing really soon and things are gonna start to pick up I have a ton of different events I have to go to um, some from work as some for Courtney stuff that's coming up and performances and all those things and going out of town and everything else that comes with work and life so I'm trying to make sure that I get ahead in my content creation and it really helps now that I'm like super excited about content again. I'm honestly so happy right now editing this first like 
vlog in this new series. I'm drinking matcha lemonade and it's really helping me get my productivity juices together. But it's been so fun exploring my editing style with these vlogs that I have in mind for you all and I'm super excited to bring them to y'all i am like extremely nervous i can't even lie i'm extremely nervous to get done with this first vlog because i have no idea how it's going to be perceived i hope everybody likes it because i really like what i'm doing right now and i can't wait to do more of it like i said in like a couple vlogs ago the creative juices are starting to flow again and that's been a really fun experience because now it's like I have ideas I'm excited about content creation again and hopefully people understand where I'm coming from I am like extremely nervous because some of the vlogs that I've done in the past haven't really necessarily performed well but that's okay because I I know I love what I'm doing and I'm excited about content again and I want to start making sure that I'm creating content for me, of course, because I definitely got lost, lost in the sauce about creating content purely for my audience. But at the end of the day, I still care about y'all. I still care about my audience. Of course I do. So if y'all have any content that you would like to see from me, I'm always open to suggestions. So go ahead and leave a comment, DM me or any questions or anything like that. I'm always open to anything y'all have to say. So, you know, be nice, of course. Be nice. Don't be coming out being rude and be like, we don't want to see this ish anymore. Like, don't be doing that. But, like, if you have ideas and suggestions, I know somebody mentioned a um, what I eat in a day. I think that would be an interesting concept because I haven't even explored anything really in that realm. And I do like cooking now. And I feel like we do a lot of stuff from scratch. So it would be a very labor intensive video, but I think that would be pretty fun. Um, and especially since fall is coming up and all those things, we can have some nice cozy meals in there. I think I might have to do that one or at least incorporate a little bit more cooking content or these upcoming like cozy winter cold months. Like it, that sounds like a good idea. So you know who you are when you mention that like that sounds like a really good idea so if you have any more ideas please let me know i'm gonna go ahead and get back into work but cheers to productivity and i'll see y'all in a little bit because i have a ton of cleaning that i need to do i just want to say again just echoing the sentiments in those last clips that i truly do appreciate each and every one of you that have me in this new direction of content that I'm trying to do with more lifestyle thrown in there of course we're still going to tackle all the beauty things but I really do appreciate y'all for understanding why I wanted to pivot some of my content so I'm cleaning up the kitchen I'm putting away groceries because I just went grocery shopping not too long ago and I wanted to make sure that I got everything where it needed to go and I just wanted to clean up a little bit after I put away all the groceries because the kitchen needs it. I feel like the kitchen is never all the way clean like it needs to be. We're constantly in there cooking and making meals and doing all this stuff. And we've been meal prepping so much that the kitchen is getting dirty so fast because we're actually eating like three meals a week every single day in there. So is it gets dirty so quick so i just wanted to wipe down pretty much all the surfaces in the kitchen and get it together because it was a mess Good morning y'all. I am about to clock into work in a little bit. It's about 
7 15 i've been trying to wake up a little bit earlier just so i can talk to y'all but also like get my day started and not just like hop out the bed and like clock in straight away but today i wanted to try out a style with my braids because they've been a little tight so i haven't like done anything really except get them out of my face for the most part but i want to try to do like a high bun real quick because it's almost time i'm like halfway it's been about two weeks since i had my braids in and i only plan to keep them in for about four to six weeks max so i still want to play around in the braids before they get to looking a little rough and before i take them out but right now it's been about two weeks and they still look really well. I am going to go ahead and wash them either today or tomorrow and I'll film that process for you all. So I got this little scrunchie from YGN or You Go Natural. Yes, is that the name? Yes, that's the name. They recently launched in Target a couple months ago and so they sent me some PR but I haven't got too many chances to play around with the scrunchie. The fun thing about this scrunchie is one that it's huge and then the other thing is it has this little adjustable band right here. So I want to see if it can hold the weight of my braids because I did feel like I needed something a little bit more like not heavy duty but something that can hold the weight of my braids. So let me go ahead and tilt my head over. Okay, so I do wish that I got less of my edges braided up because I definitely feel the weight of this on my edges right now. Okay, Scrunchy, it's, doing, it's trying. It's trying to do what it needs to do. I wish I got one that I like was a bit thicker, but this is really like discreet, like you can't really tell. Okay, so I don't want this to be super tight, so I'm okay with it being a little messy on the sides because I do not want to pull at my edges anymore. Alright messy bun, that's pretty cute. That looks cute! Alright, let's go ahead and get ready for work. My morning wouldn't be complete if I didn't have some type of matcha up and through my morning routine. So today I'm making a really quick matcha lemonade. I love just using my organic matcha and mixing it with a little bit of Simply Lemonade. If I'm feeling fancy, I might do like a little like pump of lavender syrup in there. But today I'm just leaving it simple as matcha and lemonade and throwing in some ice cubes. And this is my drink for today's morning. Well, lately I've been liking to start my day outside and get some sunlight into my life. I'm about to go ahead and clock in. But thank you all so much for joining me for this vlog. If you like this type of content, make sure you go ahead and like and subscribe and I'll catch y'all in the next one. Bye y'all.